welcome to my channel today. Today's Sunday. I hope you're having a happy Sunday. Uh, I've been asked to do a swipe uh, with a specific colors and specific way of doing it. So I'm going to try to recreate something else I did, which I know is almost impossible. But I am going to change a few things around. I've added some pearlescent to my semi-gloss white, which I'm going to put down first layer on. And then I have a lot of different colors that I've put together, like all the different blues and the pinks and reds and the purples and a little bit of green and yellow, which I'm going to put down. And I'm also trying a new idea for a swiping tool, a shelf liner. I hope it works. It's light. It's not like uh, cardboard, which I tend to push too hard on. And I don't even know if I have to wet it or not. So I'm just going to try it and find out. More experiments. So I have my uh, Deco Art Peacock Pearl. All my paints are mixed. One part paint, two parts Floetrol. I have Arteza Pearl Sea Green and Montmartre Deep Cayenne, Artist Loft Deep Turquoise, and this blue uh, could be Satin Blue Deco Art and Artist Loft Metallic Cobalt. And then in my red and pink category, this is Cadmium Red Light, Arteza Pearl, Amaranth, and Primary Elements Jasmine, which is not mixed with Floetrol. It's mixed with the color art, um, stuff that you get with the color art. Um, this lost its label. It's some kind of a pink. And I have, this is a pink fluorescent, by that name I can never can pronounce, Senelier, Senelier, I don't know how to pronounce it. And then I have, um, this is like a magenta. I have my gold mica powder, um, rich art purple one part paint and I only have one part flow troll on here as it's kind of like a craft paint and so I figured it didn't need that much flow troll. Arteza's Violet and Deco Art Berry and in my green I also have Satin White and these two, now I may not use all of them, but that's what I have out here. I have Arteza's Pearl Lime Green and Pearl X uh, with Pumpkin Orange. And this has Deco Pour in it. It's when I was using Deco Pour. So they're my colors. Um, I will decide what to do, where to put it. And I hope this new swiping tool works well. We don't know, but we're going to find out. Okay, this is my board. I have it taped in the back. It's uh, 20, 16 by 24. And I have a thin layer of the white with the pearlescent in it already on here. So I'm going to use gold as my swipe color. And I have an idea of what I need to do here. So we're going to give this a try. Now this has been kind of a, a special request. So we're going to give it a try. Hopefully it will come out. I'm trying to keep the colors grouped. 
So when the uh, swipe, when I do the swipe, this is basically a swipe with intention. And before I swipe, I'm going to have to remove all these paints from my table or I won't have any room to swipe. I have such a small area to work in. Toothpick. I rearranged, I got another cabinet and I rearranged all my paints in. It's been very interesting. Where's that? There it is, green and the peach and the purple and the dark. And then we gotta go to the blue. trying to get enough paint on here to achieve what I want to achieve. This is a bigger canvas than I normally work on and uh, with such a small area to work with, it's rather difficult. All right, we have the blue. We have to do some of this. color here and some of this there I don't know what this pearl will do underneath uh, the layer of pearl that I have under there so I'm interested to see what that does
I've used puddles before and I like the outcome. So we'll see how that comes out. the light and then I'm going to add the little bit of darker to that and to that color I'm going to add a little bit of this color Well, I think I have enough paint. We're just gonna give that a try. So I gotta get rid of one of these paints to have room. Okay, I've removed most of the bottles. And so I'm going this way. And this is the shelf liner that I'm gonna to try to use as my swiping instrument. Um. I don't think I'm going to wet it if I start here and see how it picks up the gold. The only thing I didn't do before I swiped was my handy dandy little torch. And I want, I think I want a little more on the sides. I'm not sure. Maybe this will be okay. I see a place where I'd like to add a little bit of this color. And a little bit over here. And to swipe that, I'm probably gonna use a paper towel. I think the shelf liner works great. I just needed a little more paint. That's what I wanted there. So we'll torch that. Yep, 
that's kind of what I'm looking for. I wanted these to kind of be individual. Um, it's not so much individual down there, but I'm going to try to do something about that. Um, may mess it up, but you don't know till you try it. to put my swiping color over it. I'm curious to see how that looks when it's dry. I like how the purple is coming through the blue here and through the gold and that fluorescent there. So I'll give you a close-up. Well, here's a close-up. It's pretty large, as you can see. I really like the 12 by 12 size best. That's the bottom. And there's the middle. And the top. Well, I hope you like my video. And if you do, please subscribe and share. And don't forget to hit that bell so you get notified when all videos are uploaded. Thank you very much. See you during the week. Bye-bye.